guys, today we're talking bone conduction headsets. So why do you want one of these? We'll find out in just a few seconds. What's up YouTube, Dave here with Scene Through a Lens and thanks for stopping by the channel. We make lifestyle videos and all things tech, so if that's your kind of thing, then please consider subscribing to the channel and clicking on the bell icon so you could be notified of new videos. So guys, yes, today I am taking a look at these, the Runner Diver Bone Conduction Headset. Now, Bone Conduction Headset, right? What's the deal? Well, let me tell you, you see, this headset, unlike conventional headsets, does not fire music directly into your ears. The ears can be very sensitive or even impaired. But you know what it's like? You're listening to a bit of bat out of hell, you start on volume five, but very soon your ears get used to that volume. And before you know it, you're dancing around, shaking your head, and you're on volume 10. And whilst it makes us feel alive, it's also potentially damaging our hearing and the consequence of that damaged hearing is no more bat out of hell or potentially anything so guys i'm not a hearing or health expert but the folks that are you will relate to this what is the answer yeah bone conduction as rather than blasting the old eardrums with all of that sound you actually wear these like this, in front of your ears. So the vibration is on the bone rather than the noise in the ears. And that's what creates the sound. Now, actually, these are really comfortable. And if I was wearing a conventional pair of headphones, I wouldn't even be able to hear myself talking to you now. So yeah, really good. And if you've already got impaired hearing of any kind, well, this tech could be a great solution as it's bypassing your ears. But guys, these runner divers are actually suited to just that. If you're a runner, potentially on the streets, you wanna have all your wits around you. You want to be cognizant of your surroundings, especially traffic. So having your ears open and free makes this setup a lot safer for you. And that's pretty cool. And the fact that these are pretty much sealed units with no speaker grills, you can use these while you are swimming. Yes, swimming. I mean, guys, let's face it, doing lengths for some of us is pretty damn boring. It is for me. But having your top playlist on this is definitely going to make swimming a lot more fun now guys just for clarity nayenka sent me this runner diver headset to review in exchange for my honest opinion and if you follow my channel you'll know that whatever i review you're always going to get my honest opinion good bad or indifferent so obviously guys i've already unboxed these but for you guys to take a look at what's in the box as with all Nayanka products, I've been lucky to review some of these different types of bone conduction headsets, for which I will leave a card. But like all of these Nayanka headsets, the packaging is really nice. You open the box up and you're greeted with the headset. Underneath you have some instructions and a proprietary charge lead. Yeah, I've got to say, I really don't like proprietary. But nevertheless, these bad boys have much more to offer. So you know what? It's not a huge deal. And guys, you get these earplugs, which if you are underwater or even just sitting in your living room, popping these in your ears will definitely make this headset sound pretty damn good. Now guys, let's talk about features. This runner diver is equipped with 16 gigabytes of storage. It's IPX8 waterproof and it's Bluetooth 5.2 enabled. And guys, if you are in the comfort of a gym, maybe you will be connected to Bluetooth to your phone. But guys, underwater, yeah, I know phones are waterproof, but I still wouldn't want to go swimming 
with my thousand pound phone. So guys, 16 gigs of storage, it's gonna carry a lot of songs for you and you can leave your phone on the old terra firma. Now guys, battery life is pretty respectable at around 10 hours with a charge time of around 90 minutes. Build quality is good. It, it kind of uses this um, flexible titanium alloy for durability, lightness and strength. And as far as controls goes, guys, you've got a power button on one side and you've got the plus and minus buttons. And with these buttons, guys, you can perform an array of different functions, including music playback, pause, track, skipping, volume adjustment, making and taking calls, and a ton more. You can even activate your phone's voice assistant. So guys, for a cool headset that is not going to damage your ears, and it's gonna give you pretty good sound. It looks pretty good. It's very, very solid on the head. So if you're running, swimming, whatever, you're not gonna lose them. And guys, if you have impaired hearing, you can still run and swim with these and more. So guys, for a slice of great tech, this runner diver bone conduction headset from Nayenka is going to be the one to beat. Guys, I will leave any pricing and product links in the description. And if you have any comments or questions, you know what to do. And if you like the video, then please consider subscribing to the channel and clicking on the bell icon to be notified of new videos. Guys, thanks for watching and thanks to Nyanka for sending me this little slice of the future. I'm Dave with Scene for a Lens and I will see you the next time. Bye for now.